Minasan Konnichiwa, this is David. Today we are going to be taking a look at the Kuranai weapon system, um, the Build Fighter Support Weapon Kit. Um, this, of course, is the supplement kit to the Gundam Amazing Red Warrior. Um, yeah, it looks like, yes, it looks like all of these pieces are actually in the Amazing Red Warrior kit. Um, so if you just want these, um, and you're going to get the Amazing Red Warrior anyway, um, they're already in there. But if you like these weapons and you want to put them on something else, you can always pick it up. Um, and it looks like it has a couple of sword pieces here, a little pistol piece, um, this giant bazooka looking thing, um, reminiscent of the Mega Bazooka. It's got a chain gun, um, some sort of uh, flamethrower beam <laughs> rifle thing, and a tiny little beam rifle thing. So. No nunchuck gun. Though. No nunchuck gun. And these are, beyond a shadow of a doubt, the exact same runners that are in the Amazing Red Warrior. So, just just so you're aware. Um, and we have, yep, yeah, everything that I listed there, just in simple pieces. Um, this isn't a backpack or anything like that, so it doesn't need any adapters. It's this is just mole guns. Yep, it's just guns. Um, it's just HG style, um, 1144 guns. Although, some of the HG pieces that I've seen lately have been advertising that you can use them in 1-100s. Um, I know I was looking recently at the HIMOX weapon system, and it has the advertisements for it that say that you can use them in the 1-100s. Um, so that's kind of a not very well hidden fact. Um, they just look a little smaller, that's all. And sometimes that's good because in anime you get big weapons that are a little absurd. A little? Yeah, if you put them on a 1-100 kit, they actually look pretty reasonable. <laughs> um, yeah, real simple setup. Like stray swords and stuff. Oh yeah, 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 with the astrays, <laughs> yeah. Although the astrays have swords that are pretty much scaled to their size. They're mm. just, you know, they're big because they're supposed to be. Mm. Well, it actually does have a couple of little adapters here, uh, which is cool. These are um, adapters that will fit on the skirts of pretty much every HG style Gundam. So if you hate those skirt parts, put on a gun instead. Yeah, well, this is a, this is a great little way. Like, I that mean, way. it's it's um it's subtle. It's not very pronounced, but it's a great way to modify and customize your kits. Mm. Um, instead of having a skirt, you can have a fucking cannon. Yeah, I, um, I hate skirts, so. Yeah, I mean, skirts are the parts that always fall off anyway. So. <laughs> and you lose them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. They're they're pretty terrible, um, and in HG at least they are um, a nightmare. Um, some MG kits even so, and then they've even got um, little hinges here, so you can add more space to it, um, so they can sort of flare out a little, um, and they've got a little bit of range of motion. Mm -hmm. So um, nothing spectacular. It's a series of guns, but you know they put a little bit of love into it, and there you go. Um, if you like our videos, please thumbs up, like, subscribe, um, you know, drop us a comment, the, the things that every YouTube channel tells you to do. Um, <laughs> until next time, everyone, matane. Matane.